Uh, hi guys, my name is my 101 here here with a uh, hack opening. So, if you're wondering my setup here, well, today I did go to see the Yu Gi Oh! 5 these Bonds Beyond Time movie, and I got this mini manga for all this in the back. You know, you know, for all you people that go, did go to see the movie today. And I also have this Yu Gi Oh! Millennium World. World Volume 4. I got it for like cheap $2. And it came with a free promo card. So yeah. And if you're wondering, this is like Shining Jump September 2010. So I decided to get that for promo card too. So yep. For my Olympic Starters Dragon, you know, now I finally have it. For that one person, you know who you are. You know, I won't. I don't, I don't want your Malefic Stardust Dragon anymore because I have my own now. Here's a picture of the awesome card. And its effect, which you guys can read. You guys do choose so. Just pause to read. So, from the Millennium World, I got Judgment of the Pharaoh, which is, you know, a pretty cool card to get. I really. <laughs> who knew they actually did print these? Still. But it's pretty cool. And you get like the other cards, the usual friendship and the unity. Here's the effect of it. That's Tim. In his feral form. And the, and with the Yu-Gi-Oh! Fighties manga, I got the Mythic Red Eyes Black Dragon. It looks pretty sick. At least it does really look sick. Yep, the exact same one I was talking about in my Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG News Episode 1, so... Yeah, on to the main part of, you know, today's episode. I got a Lost Millennium Booster Pack and five of these Bond Beyond Time movie packs. So, yeah. The movie. So, actually, first, you know, here's, like, the backs of these, you know. You, can, you guys can read these if you really feel like it. And the awesome one that talks about the movie. Yeah, I actually really did enjoy the movie watching it today, you know. Yes, so, you know, before anything else, I'm going to have to open these blisters, so. Yeah, while I'm doing that, I'm just going to talk about some things. Yeah, I, I really did enjoy go to see, watch, to see the movie, you know. It's pretty awesome, you know. It was more epic than I thought, you know. No, I definitely am going to buy the DVD when it does come out. I mean, in my area, there are some people that watch it, you know, there are mainly, like, kids watching it, you know. Now, I was going to watch this movie no matter what, because, you know, I'm a loyal fan of Yu-Gi-Oh. I can't say I've started since, like, day one of Yu-Gi-Oh, you know, when it first came to the States, because, you know, back then I was, like, you know, not old enough, you know, I was in, like, six plus years, you know. I was like, you know, like three or four back then. You know, now I'm like a teen, you know. I'm old enough to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Well, I don't play Yu-Gi-Oh, you know. I just collect. That's what I've been doing since day one. Just collecting my Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So, yeah. The movie was like a, about like an hour or so. And the first few minutes were just like a like flashback scenes, you know, telling you guys the backgrounds about the characters. Which is like, you know, okay, I guess. And then, you know, it came to all this other stuff about present day 5Ds and Paradox Steel. Actually, <laughs> uh, almost spoiled it for you guys, but hope you guys go see the movie, get the free Mystic Red Eyes. Yep. Washed in 3D. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Too bad Kaibo wasn't in it, you know. That would have been so awesome if Kaibo was in the movie. For like, well, at least one, one or two minutes. The only thing he was in was in the flashback scene, which was pretty suckish, because, you know. We showed him, like, as a bad guy. <laughs> But yeah, other than that, 
I enjoyed the movie. So, yeah, and then you know, after the movie, I went to go find, like, these packs. Yep, I found them at Walmart because Target didn't have any of them, fortunately. Uh, yep. Yeah. Five movie packs. So first we're going to start out with this Lost Millennium, first edition. I found this out like the bargain bin at uh, Walmart. There's like like eight packs, you know, seven Lost Millennium and one Gladiator's Assault. I mean, Force of the Breaker, you know. The only reason I got this was because it was in the uh, first edition, you know, the only one. All the other ones were in, like unlimited, so yeah. Hope I don't really hope to get anything good out of this, you know, it's just fun opening like some older packs I won't exactly call this old school you know but I can't call it older so yeah let's see what I pull out of this uh, Grave Oha I guess said nothing good Element to hear a spark man. Yeah, I guess that's a okay card. I kind of like it. I like the alternate artwork version better, you know, the one from the starter deck. So, yeah. Rare out of that, you know, and I, I wasn't really expecting anything. Uh, first pack, you know. So then I was kind of hoping that they had the artwork for the with the Malefic Blue as White Dragon here and the Sever Engine. You know, yeah, but it's too unfortunate they didn't have that artwork version of it. So, yeah, this is back, you know. Each, you know, it's kind of different from, you know, what you regularly see. Yeah. Let's get opening. First pack. Yep, I saw some videos of this already opening. Openings of this. The OCG Japanese ones were like the ones with the blue eyes on it. Yes, and I hope to get like one of every card. Junk Gardener. Malefic World, Malefic Claw Stream, Malefic Red Eyes, and Malefic Rainbow Dragon. So, so yeah, I'm gonna make a recap later of this. The second pack. No, and it was interesting today that at Walmart, no, I actually found like a. a a blister box of uh, uh actually before that <laughs> security tag. So yeah. Found a blister of Storm and Ragnarok packs, you know, like a blister box seriously. Oh my god, this is the exact same pack as the last one. So so yeah, I found a blister box with like 20 blisters in it. You know, I'm not really interested in the new pack of Storm Ragnarok. Yes, third pack of this. Oh my god, this is the exact same pack again. I'm I'm really I'm getting pretty mad now.
Ooh, Par Malefic Paradise Dragon. <sighs> oh my god, I'm so pissed right now, you know. I got almost every card except for Cyber and Dragon, so... Uh, I'll make a recap later.